I thought it, on the one hand, it was extremely accurate. The parents' clothes would all be hanging in my parents' closet. Uh, and at the same time, um, Elio's clothes are, are so nicely between boy and man. Uh, could you talk a little bit about those two? Thank you. I will, I will tell this to Giulia Persanti, the costume designer. Uh, it was very important for us that for the movie not to look period, and for the movie not to look, uh, in a way, a reflection of the 80s, uh, uh, the way usually cinema does uh, when it becomes period. You know, like, it's very difficult to uh, resist the temptation of uh, thinking of a period uh, from our perspective, and to say, okay, our idea of the 80s, I mean, you see, you see for instance, uh, uh, a masterpiece of all times that is uh, 2001 and we can't deny the fact that there is a lot of courage and that there is a lot of 60s um, futuristic fashion in the way Kubrick and his team put together the idea of 2001. In fact, 2001 wasn't like that when we got there, finally. Uh, uh, so, and I respect that, I like that, I like that. Another way of making a costume design that is striking and astonishing is like what Milena Canonero did with Dick Tracy the idea of the cartoon 40s and Hollywood was fantastic. But what I prefer for myself is to be invisible, to really try to, uh, uh, which is probably the greatest of the artifices, to reconstruct something that is not anymore, but try to be as close to what was it. So we had a lot of research. One thing we did, Crema is a very small village, so we found the possibility to enter in other people's houses and they gave us their pictures of their, their 80s. So we had like a big, big book, and we, we discovered a lot. For instance, not all the ladies had big shoulders. Not all the ladies had big hair. This is something that is became a sort of a canon of the 80s uh, representation, but that's not exactly how it was. And again, the Maurice Pialat film was also a great guy, because that is a 1983 film. Um, yeah, I like in, in, in t talking about coffee, I like very much how Julia did the indicated where Elio is going at the very end of the movie with this kind of uh, a new romantic look. Right? It was a very, 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 very beautiful. And, and you know, like sometimes when you work in a movie and you have like 50 people around you, everyone has their own film. And when she came with this uh, shirt full of faces looking here and there, I really found it beautiful because uh, she found this idea that was very strong for him. It was very strong and it helped me to put that last image together.